This is the JBL Go 4 Bluetooth version 5.3 and it's using Aura Cast. Some more information on the back. They say grab and go. Seven hours of playtime, IP67, uh, and it works with a JBL portable app. So yeah, let's uh, unbox it. I really like this uh, JBL logo on this one. Let's take it out. Nice uh, rubber feet. Big play button. So you could stay uh, all flat or standing up. And I really like this uh, handle as well. Really good. What else does it come with? Uh, I think we have some um, charging cable in here. So yeah, that's the usual JBL USB-C to USB-A uh, charging cable. Uh, quite short, but it will do. And then you have some instructions. Okay, let's have a quick look around. So on the left side we have the power button, Bluetooth and uh, Anatel I think it's called. That's like party cast. Um, on this side you have Go uh, 4 and then you have the USB-C charging cable on the top charging port and on top you have the play uh, volume up and down buttons. Um, and yeah on the back uh, you have some uh, rubber feet so it will stay flat or you can use this uh, rubber feet to put it in this position. So let's just see if it has any uh, if it's charged. As a light indicator in the screen, um, as you can see, and it just stopped the recording, um, and uh, you can just go ahead and set it up. Well, I've paired, um, and now I'll just say done. Okay, so uh, <clears throat> this is how it looks like in the app. It shows um, uh, how much battery it has. Um, there's a software update, uh, I'm not going to do that just now. And then there's the JBL signature, uh, chill, energetic, vocal, and you can even customize. And now you have uh, five, you, um, five bands, uh, where before, I think with the other ones, you would only get um, three bands equalizer. So that's quite good. Um, then you have the playtime boost. What would this do? Louder music with longer playtime. Uh, playtime boost will uh, boost up the volume of your music, uh, but consume less less battery. That's interesting. Under this mode, uh, the EQ is disabled. Okay, makes sense. Uh, and then uh, uh, again, you have the product information and firmware update in there, and you can do stereo group. Uh, so you can pair it with another uh, JBL uh, product. So yeah, guys, um, that's the JBL Go 4. Looking forward to test it. So yeah, um, it's now paired with the phone. Uh, and yeah, let's play some music.
so now what I want to show you is how it compares so how JBL uh, by the way was at maximum volume um, initially it was 50% um, so I just want to show you how the JBL clip whatever it is it's not clip it's uh, the JBL Go 4 um, how it compares with the Tribit Micro 2 uh, so we'll uh, I'll uh, connect that and I'll show you in just a second okay so I'm gonna start again with the uh, Tribit 50% uh, volume for now because this one is quite loud <laughs> So let's just start this uh, track from the beginning, but I already can feel it in the floor, um, the bass, so uh, it seems like it's uh, a bit stronger, so I'm going to increase it to the maximum and see how, how it goes. either so let's see how the JBL uh, go for sounds obviously it's a bit smaller in size and it is not as heavy as the Tribit Tribit has two passive radiators um, so yeah let's just see so let's connect we'll just turn this track back a bit and uh, let's connect the JBL go there you go
Jesse, half volume. And that's the JBL. Tribit. Definitely Tribit sounds. Uh, So yeah guys, um, uh, definitely try bit obviously sounds a bit uh, more mature um, because it is, uh, it has two passive radiators so that definitely makes a, a difference um, otherwise um, I can feel like the JBL it's a bit better on highs and mids um, obviously none of them can do a deep bass uh, they just have a you know, boomy bass <laughs> Um, but yeah, uh, otherwise, um, you know, uh, I'm quite happy with this uh, JBL um, Go 4. It's quite portable. Um, and um, yeah, let me show you the difference. Yeah, so as you can clearly see, uh, this is way uh, uh, bigger than that. And it has uh, a passive radiator on the back as well. And this one only on the front, so it has, um, I think, a uh, uh, passive radiator and a uh, speaker. So yeah, um, there you have it, guys. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it.